Hello everyone, welcome back to Whole Bright Life. Listen, I was just sitting here in my car. Um and I had a thought. And here lately, thoughts have not just been random thoughts. They've been downloads from the Holy Spirit. So I believe this is a phrase for somebody. I know it blessed me. So the promises of God are closer than they appear. It's coming to you. It's already done. But the way it appears seems to be far off seems to be non-existent no signs um you've been getting signs and those signs are the confirmations but you've seen no materialization of what god said in the natural right so i was just sitting here and it just came to me that objects are closer than they appear because in a car you know if you have the you have the two side mirrors, right? Mirrors. And there's a note in one that says, objects may appear, appear closer than they are. Or objects in mirror are, not maybe, <laughs> are closer than they appear. Wow. So there's no maybe. I just heard that. Thank you, Holy Spirit. There's no maybe that it might be closer. It is. So shall my word be. It is. Be. State of being. You know, it is closer than it appears. Now, I'm an inquisitive person. So I was just like, okay, God, but why would they put the mirror in a car, you know, for safety precaution, why would they put a mirror that only shows you objects further away than what they are because that could cause an accident? Like why in the world would it say objects are in mirror are closer than they appear? And I sat with that and I sat with that for a moment in God's presence. And wow, what I hear right now, because God is in the now, is he doesn't want you to act like you're waiting for it. He doesn't want us to act like it hasn't been done already. Like it's already here. So you need to act like, think like, be like, because it is done. It's done. So when you're driving, you need to act like that object is closer than what it appears in that mirror. That mirror is just a forewarning. That mirror is just a glimpse. Mm. So God has given you glimpses of his glory. Um, to show you that what has not been seen is eternal, that it is what it is, that he cannot lie, that he cannot lie, mm. and he is the God who spoke everything that is into existence. There was nothing made that was made without the spoken word of God. He spoke it before it was done. He called those things that be not as though they already were because they are. Good God Almighty. So that mirror, you know, in our cars is only a glimpse. It's only showing you a glimpse. It's not giving you the exact location of what God has promised or in a car, you know, it's not giving you the exact location of that car that's beside you. So you just need to be ready. You just, mm, you just need to watch. You just need to be, you know, you need to be, I don't even know what that means, but <laughs> you just need to be on it. You know, you need to get into it. 
as the young people say, get into it, you know? It is what it is. Smile, you know? Um, smile, you know? Um, get in the right frame of mind that it's already done. It's already here. You need to act like that car is already up on you so that you can get over to the other lane at the right time. You know, you need to prepare for it to be closer than what it appears. That blessed me. So, we're not waiting on it. We're not waiting on it because, see, then that means you're looking at the promise. Like, what is taking you so long? Why are you not here? What's going on? What's the holdup? We start thinking that it's holdups and something's delaying it. And it's like, I declare, ain't nothing being held up. Come on, Dietrich Haddon. It's open door season. So act like that object, that promise is closer than what it appears because it is. <laughs> Y'all be blessed until God gives me another word, a release. Have a good day.